So Yulia's made a decision that she wants to buy one piece of jewelry from every country we visit, just as a memory of our travels. So yeah, I already bought this in Hai, in the north of Thailand, and now I'm looking for something from the south of Thailand. Yeah. And since our time here in uh, the south of Thailand is pretty much coming to an end soon, we've decided that we have to take one of our free evenings here to have a look and see if we can find something. So we decided that tonight we're gonna actually check out the night market here in Kolanta. So you would think that we found a good place for Yulia to look? She should be able to find something here, but... Knowing you? Probably not. Who is this? She's in the middle of the street parking. <laughs> it's so tempting to take it for a ride. <laughs> Maybe a little bit unethical if there's a crying kid coming running after me. I'm back. So I think not. Yulia? Yeah? What do you think if I got a... Mixed fruit what bag. <laughs> Yulia, can I buy this banana? This is not even funny. <laughs> Yulia, what about this banana, ba <laughs> banana backpack? I'm gonna ignore this. What happened to your finger? Uh, I put it in the, vent in the fan actually in our room. Unintentionally, obviously. <laughs> Didn't stop bleeding. I got really nauseous. Yeah, you're screaming. <laughs> I was crying. crying. <laughs> That was horrible, honestly. It's okay. Now I'm a little afraid of the fan. It is honestly ridiculous how many speeds there are on this island. They're like swarming the place. In Kopangan and Kotao, I would say there's like the majority are German. But here, there's from Sweden. I'm pretty sure. You easily get the impression that the Kulanta night market is not as popular as the one on Kopangan and Kotao. I think it's generally and at least because not in, the yeah. island is empty, you know? Yeah, definitely. <gasps> and compared to Chiang Mai, this is like nothing. <laughs> oh, you want sunglasses? But you never wear sunglasses. Because I don't have. <laughs> you have, you always put them in my bag. I have ugly ones. Okay, so, so we have a new goal for the day. <laughs> Find <laughs> Yulia sunglasses. <laughs> These are not even sunglasses, Yulia. So we're slightly struggling to find something that you really actually like. We're gonna head to another market that was just across the street. And it looks a little bit more expensive, but you know, she demands the best. <laughs> Obviously, I <laughs> We've made the opposite joke. <laughs> Yeah, this is just taking way too long, so I decided I'm going to try to help her now. What do you think of this one? It's a little big, isn't it? What about this one? It's a little, little huge, isn't it? What about this one? Pick you off. I don't want something blue. This is purple? No. Whales? Never mind. <laughs> this one? It's for the hair. Oh. What about a watch? <laughs> what do you think? Shake it around a little? <laughs> At least I always know where you are. <laughs> It'll be my little cow. No, I don't want it anymore. <laughs> <laughs> so now we went all the way back to the first night market and I think we're starting to land on one. <laughs> this is the elephant one <laughs> that I already found. Days ago. Yeah. <laughs> we already we've been through this before, but it's still nice, isn't it? Yeah. If you haven't seen the previous vlog, you can check it out up here. Just click on this icon here. Which one are you gonna go for? With or without <laughs> elephant? <laughs> Did you come to a conclusion? Yeah, this one it is. Okay, with an elephant. Yeah. All right. Okay, good. Awesome, let's go pay. It took like an hour. Sure. 50 plus 50 is 100. Good. 
So Julia finally decided on a bracelet, and if you know her, that's actually quite an accomplishment. <laughs> so, for two and a half euros. <laughs> for two and a half euros, we spent about an hour on this, but we're happy now. Julia's happy. I think you're happy with the bracelet. Yeah. Okay, she got one elephant. One elephant. Bye, guys. The journey continues tomorrow.